The family of a 17 year old shot and killed during a traffic stop with Greensboro police has filed a federal lawsuit. The mother of Nisanto Crenshaw says they are seeking justice and answers. Yeah, they want the department to release the officer's name and the body camera footage. WFMY News 2's Amber Lake has a closer look this afternoon. Family members of the teen were joined by attorneys today right here on the federal courthouse steps, announcing a federal lawsuit against the city as well as the officer they say killed Nisanto Crenshaw. The shooting happened on West Market Street last August. According to a release, a Greensboro police officer pulled over the driver for a traffic violation around 9 p.m. and discovered the car was stolen. Police said as the officer walked up to the car, the driver took off. When the driver was able to stop the car again, police said several people ran. Police said while the officer tried to arrest other passengers, the driver hit the gas, hitting the officer's patrol car, which prompted the officer to fire shots. Crenshaw died as a result of the shooting. Attorney Harry Daniel says Crenshaw wasn't using the car as a weapon and shots never should have been fired. But a law enforcement officer cannot shoot at a vehicle that's not in its trajectory path. In fact, most policies state right. that you cannot shoot in a moving vehicle. Okay. Why? Because if you shoot a moving vehicle, it becomes an unguided missile. Crenshaw's mother, as the lawsuit was announced, she said her son was a loving person and there was no reason for what happened. Right it's a home that can never be filled. I hurt every day. I cry all day, every day. The SBI says that they have wrapped their investigation and sent it to the district attorney's office who would determine if criminal charges are appropriate. That officer who is involved has been on administrative duty.